Identifying a tree species can be rewarding and fun. In this tutorial, we explain how city trees can assist you to successfully identify urban tree species based on the characteristics of their leaves. There are several questions you must answer as you observe the tree to be identified. Answering these questions in city trees has you work through what scientists call a dichotomous key. Let's get started. First thing you will want to do is determine whether your tree is a broadleaf deciduous, characterized by broad flat leaves that are shed in winter, or coniferous, cone bearing with needle shaped or scale like leaves. Next, if your tree is broadleaf deciduous, you will next need to describe its leaves. Ask yourself, are the leaves simple, single leaf, the leaf's blade is not divided, or compound, the leaf consists of several distinct parts, leaflets, joined to a single stem. If the leaves are compound, you will need to identify if they are pinnately compound or palmately compound. Palmately compound leaves have the leaflets that are fanned out and originate from one location, whereas the leaflets of pinnately compound leaves are arranged along a central stalk. Remember, one leaf consists of all of the leaflets. We now observe the edges of the leaves to determine if they are rough, pointed or tooth-shaped leaf edges, may appear jagged, or smooth. Still looking at the edges of the leaf, ask yourself if it is lobed, having deeply indented margins, or not lobed. To tell whether or not the leaf is symmetrical or asymmetrical, you will need to look at the base of the leaf. If the leaf on either side lines up perfectly with the stem, then it's a symmetrical leaf. If it doesn't line up, then it's asymmetrical. Finally, with our deciduous tree, we will look at a leaf attachment to the stem. You will need to observe whether the leaves are attached to the stem in an alternate, leaves grow out of the stem at one at a time, or opposite, leaves emerge from the stem in opposing pairs. Let's return now to conifers. Recall these are cone-bearing and have needles or scaly leaves. First, determine if the tree has needles, originating from the stem, singularly or in bundles, or scales, overlapping scales. If your tree has needles, you will need to observe their arrangement. They could be growing singly or in bundles of two or more. Finally, look carefully at the needles to determine whether they are straight or twisted. Sometimes, tree species identification will require you to measure the length of leaves, so a small ruler can be a handy tool. Also, a trusted tree ID book is always useful and will introduce you to other distinguishing tree characteristics, including bark, flowers, fruit, and tree structure. With practice, you will become more confident with your identification of tree species. This video describing basic tree identification methods has been brought to you by City Trees. Let's grow.